hey hey welcome back to another marvel champions live stream today we are continuing on with the magneto challenge meaning that we are going to be taking each of the four x-men each in a different aspect against expert magneto until we either cry or win that's basically how it works so we have completed this with shadow cat aggression so red the red aspect's gone and then colossus protection he is also done or not colossus i always get them mixed up i don't know why cyclops per protection today we are diving into uh colossus um sorry my music's really loud colossus and we're going to be going with the justice aspect just because there is a lot of thwarting that needs to go on and colossus is not known for his adept thwarting power so the other reason that we're doing this is we have leadership which i think is probably a really strong matchup against magneto as well and gene could do it in either leadership or protection but i think colossus really does want the yellow want wants uh justice and so we're gonna try it with justice i do have a victory with this deck against the magneto off stream so we've tried it out it i've tried it out it's worked so now we just have to do it with while well, all the pressure's on and everyone's watching so what i want to do is talk about the deck and then i guess dive into it so it's a justice deck and it's it's kind of fun um it, it's it's different than the justice deck that i ran through the campaign with because there's a couple of things that you can really tech against Magneto. And so our ally lineup, we got Professor X, who is here for Magneto's Confuse, as well as getting through this boarding party really quickly. Blindfold, because she's incredible. Wiccan for some damage. We got some really high boost cards in this deck. And so Wiccan can actually do some massive damage. I think there's a four boost in here, actually. Maybe not. Maybe I'm crazy. I could have swore there was a four boost. Maybe it just feels like I'm... Oh, there it is. There's a four boost. So, I mean, Whiffin can do some damage. Angel for the cheap ally. Jessica Jones, Eros. So, ideally, they're not going to be chump blocking because the deck is kind of built around trying to get out as much uh, stun lock as we possibly can. Stun and confuse lock, actually. So we'll want to be flipping every turn. And once we get through the boarding party side scheme, the idea is to try and keep Magneto never to activate effect basically again. So to do that, we have some sonic rifles and then also the steel fist. Yeah, steel fist stun and confuses an enemy. So Magneto can get stun and confused. Sonic rifle actually does deal. Or like we probably will use the sonic rifle for the damage output towards the end of the game because with steel fist and after we're flipping every turn we're gonna we're gonna transition about halfway through the game and probably not halfway probably 60 percent of the way through the game to using his aspiring artist ability to shuffle back in steel fist and to try and keep him locked down the entire game and so once we are being once we're able to recur steel fist multiple times then the sonic rifles don't necessarily do anything other than damage so we can get the sonic rifles out there then we're in good shape clear the area just for some thwarting for justice for some more thwarting then two beat cops i have not played with beat cops in the longest time i beat cops have just sat in the box and i haven't looked at them but they work pretty well for this matchup for two reasons um one once uh, Colossus has his Iron Will out, which is kind of the priority. We want to get Iron Will onto the table as quickly as possible. He has two. Beat Cop can take the third off of these side schemes. And then also, Beat Cop can do some massive work against these Acolyte minions. And then uh, Colossus can then focus on Magneto. And so we'll be using all of Colossus's really big attacks against Magneto. And ideally, the Beat Cops are going to ping off the minions as they come out. It's a pretty high cost deck, so we got power justices, we got the strengths, um, and then we got our, uh, I guess we got X Jet in there, and then we got Death Focus because we have so many unshakable, limitless staminas, and just for the readies and everything. So that's kind of the deck. You can also find that in either if you're watching on YouTube, the video description, or on Twitch, you can throw in the command to see what the deck looks like by the deck list command. Also, at this point, I want to shout out the sponsor of the stream. So 1985 Games is helping sponsor this stream. And if you use the 
uh, link either in the description or if you use the command sponsor in Twitch, it will take you to an affiliate link that if you buy anything from there, it goes directly to supporting this part portion part of it goes directly to supporting the stream and also get you some really cool role playing stuff. I'm also drinking a 1985 beer because I found them and I thought that was fun. Hey, Maddie, how's it going? So remind me what aspects heroes have you gone through? So we have completed this with Cyclops protection and uh shadow cat aggression so we have colossus justice and we have we have colossus and phoenix and then justice and leadership i think phoenix could do it with either um i am a little worried that colossus may struggle with the leadership just because of the slow roll i think once he gets built up colossus leadership can be very powerful but i think this is my worst case scenario is Colossus and so I'm gonna pair him with Justice if we push through the Justice then we have just Phoenix left and then we'll probably have to figure out a way to tie in Storm and um, Wolverine when they come out maybe we'll do another maybe we'll switch it up somehow but I am really excited they're coming out in like nine days yeah nine days is the second so I don't think I'm going to be able to get them on release day, sadly, but I am looking forward to both of them. They both look really cool. I'm so very excited for Storm, though. Alrighty. So, set the Orbital Decay side scheme out of play. We reveal Boarding Party. This flips over. We've got one couple of things also that they have clarified since the last Magneto challenge is that you do remove counters before you resolve the card. So it is worded incorrectly on there, but they did come out and they made the change that you remove the counters and you resolve your card. So kind of weird, but that does prevent that infinite or not necessarily infinite, but prevents that downward spiral loop. And then also I learned that any counters that remain on the main scheme while we, after you flip, those get removed. So if you have two counters on Asteroid M and you flip into your next one, then those two counters get removed. So excellent. Really excited there. Hey, boards on table. Hey, how's it going? Good luck with Magneto on Colossus. Thank you. Thank you very much. I'm, <laughs> let's see how it goes. I got I got I got a win earlier today off stream off off screen so we'll see how it goes. But if we can just get Iron Will, then I feel like we're gonna be okay. Oh okay, we got a genius and we got a sonic rifle, a four justice, an organic steel, the X Jets, and limitless stamina. So a really solid opening here. We can hang on to organic steel and the X Jet. We'll get the X Jet onto the table. And I really want to get Organic Steel onto the table. We will be able to get a second copy of Organic Steel, which we may just hang on to in our hand. But getting that tough economy just continually rolling is actually really, really critical. So since we're going to be using these for our uh, our money, we'll, we will try and see if we can get something else. We got Blindfold, another Limitless Stamina, and Angel. Okay. Excellent. So part of our setup ability, we will go grab a second copy of Organic Steel. Kind of wish we didn't get that first one, but that's fine. We, we actually could, I guess, technically toss the Organic Steel to play the Limitless Stamina, but I, I, don't, I don't really want to do that. Okay, so... After you change to this form, we can shuffle, so we don't have anything that we can do in Alter Ego. So let's go ahead and flip up. We have a response, Steel Skin. We can add a tough status card to Colossus whenever we change into that form. We'll use a Genius and a Blindfold to pay for a X Jet. So it gives a wild resource for anyone with an X Men trait. We will use the X Jet and Angel to play organic steel so after a tough status card is removed we can exhaust and remove one counter from organic steel to replenish that tough status card and then we have a limitless stamina and our organic steel in our hand um 
we will probably... We're going to toss the Limitless Stamina and hang on to this Organic Steel. We'll go ahead and thwart one off a of boarding party. Okay, let's stand up. We'll draw four cards. The Studio. There's a Titanium Muscles. That's kind of nice. And I'm made of rage. It's nice that we're starting to get our resource generators out, but really Iron Will is the key here. So we will throw one here. Magneto will... Oh, I need a face on encounter card. And he's tough. Setup, setups are fun. Magneto is going to attack. We'll take it right to the face because we got this tough. There's going to be three plus two. That's going to run into the tough. We will use Organic Steel to replenish our tough status card. And then we have to add a Magnet Counter. We got two encounter cards. The first one being Amelia Volt. And the second one being an Advance. That actually probably kills the game right there. We'll see. We got two. This is this is how it started last time with Shadow Cat. It, it went horribly. It went horrible. So two. Oh, okay. We don't move. We don't. Uh, we we don't progress. So give Magneto a tough status card and a face down boost card. So he's got this face down card. He already has a tough, and he's schemed for two. Okay, so we're about to lose Asteroid M. So that's kind of fun. Because of course we are, right? Let's use X-Jet and the Studio to pay for Titanium Muscles. So we get plus one attack. And we can exhaust this card to generate one resource for each tough status card on um, Colossus. Now, what I'm trying to figure out is do we get a second copy of Organic Steel out or do we kill Amelia with the Mate of Rage? I think it... I think we get the second copy of Organic Steel, and Amelia just kind of hangs out, which is unfortunate, but... Uh, I hate I hate this flip right here. Computer's freaking out. Um, let's go ahead, Titanium Muscle is made of rage for a second copy of Organic Steel. That comes in with two counters. Yeah. We will use this to thwart one off of here. And hopefully what kind of the hope is that we're going to draw into something that can take care of boarding party. I we're, we're in trouble. <laughs> we're in trouble. I think that's all I can say about that. So we're ready. Draw clear the area. Okay. There's boarding party unshakable, which is nice. There's an energy and a power justice. That's frustrating. That's. That's a lot of money and not a lot to spend it on. So we'll place one here. Magneto is going to attack for three plus two boost cards. We'll take it to the face, a zero and a two. So five, which will run into this tough. And this is, this is where we have to. Hmm. This is where we have to get kind of creative. So it's going to knock the tough off. And the uh, the question is, is do we want to utilize organic steel to put the tough back on or just take the one damage? And if we take the damage, we go down to 14 or 13, which is not a bad thing at all. But then we can roll down and save. Uh I think that's what we're going to do. I think we're probably going to lose lose the main. So we won't replenish organic steel because Amelia will just knock it right off. So Amelia will hit us for one and then we'll resolve an encounter card. Homesick. Oh, this is actually pretty nice. Mm. Maybe it's not actually. Okay, so we can exhaust Peter to remove Homesick from the game or discard this card in each tough status card from your identity. If you discard no tough status cards, it gains Surge. Okay, yeah, we'll go ahead and flip to Peter and exhaust. We do get to flip, or we do get to shuffle something back in, which will be a Mate of Rage. That means we probably don't have to lose the main this turn. So that's kind of interesting. 
but the risky play <laughs> so the risky play here is to clear the area on boarding party and hopefully draw into something good I don't think I don't think that's the right play though I really don't Oh, that's tough. We've already passed one for justice. Yeah, no, it's 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 not going to be worth it to risk the boarding party play. I'd rather just take it off of the main at this point. So we'll go ahead and flip up to Colossus. We get a tough start. We get we get a tough card. Uh, X Jet to play clear the area to take two off of here, and then we'll use Titanium Muscles to play Unshakable giving us steady. We'll toss the power of justice and that will be our turn. So we'll stand up. Uh, he will, we'll get a magnet card, but I don't know what else to do. We got death focus. That's nice. Made of rage. Okay. So we can take care of Amelia and a steel fist. So that could also take care of Amelia. Okay. Not bad. Not bad. Hey, you finally made it to a stream. Hey, Dirk. How's it going? Happy to have you. We are off to an interesting start. We're going to place one here on the main. Magneto is going to attack us. We'll take it right to the face. So it's going to be three plus three. It's going to knock this tough card off and put a second magnet counter on. Um... We're not going to trigger the responses on our organic steel. Um, so this will be because the magnet card is honestly probably going to knock something off. And so let's just go ahead and trigger this. They rule that you take those off first. Hey, there goes master plan. Exhaust each upgrade and support you control. Place one magnet counter on the main scheme. Boom. Okay, that wasn't horrible. Yeah, that wasn't horrible. Amelia will hit us for one, so that'll take us down to 12. Then our bad card is going to... Oh, no. Uh-oh. Uh, okay. Um, so they both activate because they have the teamwork. And so we'll get hit for four. Yeah, one, two, three, four. Health is a resource. Okay, so now now we have more more problems. Let's go ahead and made a rage a death focus. That's on screen, right? Yep, sweet. And then we will energy a steel fist. We'll deal five damage to this guy, and then when defeated, the player who defeated is stunned. That's fine because we are steady. No, wait, shoot. Never mind. Never mind. Hold on. Check this out. Uh, so we have a basic activation. <laughs> um, so Steel Fist to Amelia. Player who defeated Amelia is confused. And then we'll basic attack on Sinyaka. Have you tried Magneto with any other modular encounter sets from the expansion? Like trying him with Brotherhood or either the Sentinel sets? I have... No, I don't think I. I don't think I have. I think I've just played him in campaign, and then with this challenge with the with the expert. So, yeah, I, I don't think that I've done anything more than that. So we're ready up. We're getting really built, which is nice. We got limitless stamina. Jessica Jones is nice. Sonic rifle is less nice. Bulletproof protector. We don't have any tough status cards, which is a little. Sad. <laughs> Jeez. We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. Have you tried with any other modular sets? I feel like if you take the the acolytes out of here, it gets a lot easier. Because those are those are that's a nasty encounter set. Hey, okay, we'll place the fourth up here. Magneto will attack us for three plus a boost card. We'll take it. Uh, plus two is five. One, two, three, four, five. So we're down to three, which is tough. And then 
our bad card is going to be a M-type Sentinel with guard. Excellent. Exactly what I wanted. Okay, so let's go X-Jet. Bulletproof Protector and Sonic Rifle to play Jessica Jones. She gets plus one thwart for each side scheme in play. So let's go ahead and... Hmm. I need to kill Boarding Party. I just, I don't have the time to do it. You need to, no, thank you. I need to add a magnet counter. You are so correct. That puts us at two there. I'm, I may lose it and we'll, I think we get an M-Type Sentinel if we don't have Sabotage. Yeah, an M-Type Sentinel minion. But then we're just, then this M-Type is gonna scheme. We'll have a second M-Type scheming. That's gonna put us real close to losing the second at that point. Ah, that's tough. We could kill this Sentinel and have Jessica Jones thwart here. But I, I need my Justice cards. Where are my thwarting cards? I don't know. Let's go ahead and just attack three here. We will death focus, limit the stamina to stand up and attack and kill. When did Vita give Magneto a tough status card? I haven't yet, but thinking to trying with the Brotherhood set. It'll be it'll feel like an episode of the old cartoon, yeah, with Mystique showing up throughout. That would be cool. Yeah. Let me know how that goes. That sounds fun. We'll use Jessica Jones to thwart two off of the main. Then she's going to be a blocker for us, I think. Or we could roll down at this point. If we roll down, we lose the scheme. We don't take a magnet counter. Let's do that. We're going to flip down to Pitor. And... We'll shuffle in a bulletproof protector. Give me that iron will. Actually, just give me some thwarting cards. <laughs> Actually, iron will is a thwart card if you think about it. It gives you plus one thwart, so that could be nice too. Alrighty, we'll ready. Draw. Hey, there's there it is. Iron will. There's a Wiccan. Nice, okay. There's a clear the area. Shadow Cat. Three, made of rage. Two, four, five. Armor up. We're not gonna play armor up here. But we okay. So we we got. We're doing okay. We're doing okay. All told, if you can draw an armor up, that could stop the main from advancing. That ooh, actually. I think yeah. I think having the main not advance is better than the magnet card. So we're gonna do that. Good call. Good call, Maddie. Good call, Maddie. All right, so we will place one here. Magneto is going to activate. We will interrupt the activation and play an armor up. Flip up to Colossus. We get a tough status card when we do that. Magneto is going to attack instead. Nope, oh, wrong. Wrong card. For three plus a boost. Plus one. That will knock off the tough. We're going to trigger Organic Steel here. To put the tough back on, we're going to trigger the second organic steel to put a second tough on because I don't trust that we're not going to lose it. We have four status cards on us now. Let's go. <laughs> that organic steel is used up. Magnet counter triggers. Nope. Okay. Place two additional threat here, or place two threat here for each ally in play. So that comes in with four. It has a crisis icon. Which is not great. But now she's at a three scheme. So. Just kidding. That is great. I will take it. Our bad card is going to be Fabian Cortez. Because of course it is. Teamwork. He has Villainous. When defeated, the player defeated Fabian. Discards cards from the encounter deck until an Acolyte minion is discarded. And then we put that minion into play engaged with us. Less exciting. Okay. So first thing that we're going to do is we are Titanium Muscles and X-Jet. I'm sorry. Nope. 
X Jet and Def Focus to play Iron Will. So we get plus one thwart. And then whenever we discard a tough status card, we get to draw a card. So sweet. We will we'll thwart two off a of boarding party, which flips it over into Sabotage Master Mold with three. Jessica Jones will thwart three off of Sabotage Master Mold. And that brings in Orbital Decay with three. We do have Shadow Cat here, which is kind of fun. So if we throw Shadow Cat onto the table, we can bypass the Crisis. Or we could have Wiccan and... Wiccan can come in, he can, and we can get rid of Orbital Decay this turn, which frees us up a lot. Because Wiccan can thwart, then we have a clear the area. Let's do that. So let's use Titanium Muscles to play Wiccan. After Wiccan thwarts, we discard the top card of the encounter deck. Deal for each boost icon, we deal one damage to an enemy. So let's go ahead and thwart one off of Orbital Decay. Discard zero. Within, here he is. You know him best. Um, how many doubles have I passed? One, two. Let's go ahead and use a Shadow Cat to play Clear the Area. So we'll clear Orbital Decay. So Magneto loses Steady. Because that was the last Thor, we get to draw a card into Professor X, which will be excellent next time. <laughs> I honestly may hang on to Made of Rage. Um, I'm not. I'm going to toss Made of Rage. We're going to hang on to Professor X, though. Okay, we'll stand up. Everyone gets to stand up. Everyone stands up. Alrighty, you get to stand up. We get to draw... Bulletproof Protector, let's go. Armor up. And a for Justice. Not bad. We'll place one here. Magneto's going to attack, which we will take right to the face. So it's going to be three plus four. Oof. That tough is doing some work. So that tough soaks. Um, Iron Will will draw us a card. And to beat Cop. I'm thinking about just letting Jessica Jones block this. Because I have a Bulletproof Protector. And then I can save this Organic Steel. No. We're going to use the Organic Steel. Which we also need. That Magnet Counter right there. Which finishes that off. We'll place the Tough back on. Fabian is going to attack for one plus three. Oh, jeez. Which will knock this tough off, which will allow us to draw a card. Nabi Cop. Okay. We also have a double in here in this really small deck, so that's that's promising as well. Our bad card is going to be a gang up. The villain and each minion engaged with us attacks, because of course it does. Um. Okay. <laughs> Cool, cool, cool. Magneto is going to swing at us for three. Uh, shuffle each Acolyte minion from the discard pile back into the encounter deck. I think that's just these two. Alrighty. That's going to knock off this last tough, which will trigger Iron Will yet again into a Bulletproof Protector, which is a very sad card to see because we no longer have any toughs. It may would have been worth the block with both of these, but we're at three health. So let's go ahead and have Jessica Jones block Fabian. So one plus one. Jessica Jones dies. And we go back to our turn. This is at two. Okay. Um, let's 
Let's go ahead and have two bulletproof protectors in the X jet pay for Professor X. When Professor X enters play, we're going to confuse Magneto. We're going to use the Professor to thwart three off of magnetically sealed. He'll take one consequential damage for that. And we will have Whiffin go ahead and take that last one. Discard. Hey, two. Let's go. So we'll put the two damage on Fabian. Then we have a couple of options. I think we just beat cop here. We get a beat cop onto the table. We could. Yeah, that's what we're going to do. So we're going to use an armor up before justice and a beat cop to play a beat cop. We will exhaust a beat cop. It gets one counter. We'll remove one from asteroid M. We will swing and kill Fabian. So we discard until we get an Acolyte minion. It's actually not the worst one to get right now because we can just take him out with one basic attack. So that's nice. We are not going to deck, thank goodness. So we're in a little bit of a sticky spot, but we're good. We're having a good time. Okay, so we will stand up, draw four cards, power justice, strength, there's all my money, steel fist, and an arrows. Okay, not a bad hand. We will place one here. Magneto is going to attack, but Professor X step in and take it. So it's going to be three. Um, Actually, you know what? No, we're going to have Wiccan take this one. Because there's a boost card that, or there's a magnet card that deals one damage to everyone. And so if Wiccan takes it, or if we draw that, then we won't have a blocker for uh, Sinyaka here. So Wiffin's going to take it. It's going to be a zero. That will trigger our magnetic counter. Deal one damage to each character you control. There you go. So that that's why, that's why we did that. So... Professor X is going to take a damage. I'm going to take a damage. We are down to two. And then place one magnet counter on the main scheme. Boom. Sinyaka is going to attack. We'll defend with Professor X. And then we hope. Under fire. Surge and reveal the top card. Exhaust each upgrade and support you control. Not great. Place one magnet counter on the main scheme, so that goes to two. And then, oh no, Magneto's helmet. He cannot be confused. No. No. Oh, geez. Because why not, right? Because why not? Okay. Well, let's see what happens. Jeez. Okay, so... Yo. So we could get rid of that, but then we we lose basically. I think we I think we roll down regardless. I'm okay losing the main at this point. We're going to deck. We're we're in we're in a hot sticky situation, y'all. Let's go ahead and attack here. Which will stun me. We have to get their second status card. You found once you have your tough economy, you have the worst time trying to get back in. Yeah, once you lose it, it's tough. It's really tough. Never managed to take down Magneto with Colossus Justice. Really, yeah. It's a tough matchup. I, I think Colossus struggles with Magneto. This hurts. This hurts so much. Um, We actually may hang on to Steel Fist and Strength. No. Do we have a limitless stamina? There's one, two, three. No, I don't know what that last card is. I'm thinking about just playing this to clear the stuns. 
I know I'm at least playing a justice for arrows. We'll use arrows to thwart down this main. I'll take one consequentials. Mm. Yeah, th see this is this is tough. We will be flipping down this turn because we can guarantee an organic steel goes back in, which is which is really good. Um I think I'm just going to I'm going to hang on to the strength. I'm going to toss the steel fist. We'll flip down. We'll figure out how to get rid of these stuns later. Um, and we'll shuffle a organic steel back into our deck of one card. Hey, Salsa. How's it going? Here you are. Rock you like a hurricane. How's everything going? Okay, so we will ready. We will draw Steel Fist. Oh, it's a Steel Fist. An Organic Steel. We deck. I'm great. Nice seeing you at this time. Glad to hear it. I'm glad to hear that you are good and glad to see you as well. Oh, my goodness. Stressful, stressful, stressful. Oh, we got an Energy. All of the money. Hey, there's Angel. So two, four, five, and a steel fist. All of the steel fist. Just every single steel fist you have, I want it. Okay, we're going to place one here. Magneto's going to scheme for three plus two, which pops the main. But it does remove these magnet counters, which is nice. When revealed, place one magnet counter here. If Sabotage Master Mold is not in the victory display, it is. We don't have to continue reading. Factory Online starts with one. We have one magnet counter on it. You still doing the challenge? I think I, I'll participate as well. Nice. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, do it. Tell us how it goes. I'm so excited. It's fun. It's definitely fun. It's. I think this is the most I've ever played one villain back to back to back other than like Rhino when I first got the game. And so um, and so it's like you, you learn the villain. You learn kind of what he can do. And it, it really does make a difference, which is kind of fun. Master Mold was sabotaged, yet the factory is online. Eh, don't, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. <laughs> All the Steel Fists belong to us. That is so true. Okay. We've got two encounter cards. Zeal for the cause. When revealed, resolve each when defeated ability of each Acolyte minion engaged with you. If you're not engaged with an Acolyte minion, discard cards from the top of the deck until a minion is discarded. I don't even know if we have any mi oh just kidding amelia and then our next card no it's delgado that's that's that hurts actually a lot so that's going to scheme for three take us up to four hmm. less excited about that did boards on the table make a zero wing reference? <laughs> Indeed I did, sir. I'll record maybe by the time I'm done, Wolverine and the Storm will be out and I'll have them too. Yes. Yes. I'm hoping. They're, they're, they should be out here in about nine days. So that's exciting. Okay, so we have targets for Steel Fist now, so that's kind of exciting. We do have a recovery of four. I'm trying... We have two health. And it's like, it's so... Ah... Hmm. So I have a steel fist, which can kill Amelia, which would confuse us, which not the end of the world. Delgado is going to be a bigger issue. We have Angel. Well, we have ain't well, hmm. I need to pay organic steel. Hmm. Yeah, there's the deck list. 
Difficult decisions. I think... So I'm looking at probably taking two attacks. I have Eros and a tough card that can soak one of them. So I think we kill Amelia. We have Delgado that can come out. Yeah, so... I'm trying to figure out if I want to recover or just attack. I think I'm going to attack to get rid of these stuns. When I flip up, I get the tough status card. So I flipped up, I attacked, I got rid of the stuns. So that allows us to do this. We got titanium muscles and the X jet to play organic steel. Is this? Yeah, that's on the tape. That's on the screen. That comes in with two. We're going to use energy to pay for Steel Fist, which will kill Amelia, which will confuse us. Then... We're going to have Strength pay for Angel. We'll have Beat Cop take one from the main. There are too many minions. I've run into too many minions. <laughs> um, we're going to have Angel hit Delgado for two. And he'll take two. But then that sets us up that we can use a Steel Fist to take him out next turn if we need to. And protects are tough because we'll kill him, so we won't take the retaliate damage. Eros is going to hang out because we need him as a blocker. So we'll stand up. Did I have used his... No, we're good. Okay. Steel Fist. Bulletproof Protector. That's nice. A four Justice. And a Shadow Cat. Alrighty. So we'll place one here on Factory Online. Magneto is going to attack us. We'll take it right down to the face. Plus two, and there goes Shadows. We'll trigger Organic Steel to place the tough status card back. And we'll draw into Blindfold. Okay. Why are you taking two Confused cards? So I am steady. So I need two Confused cards to be considered Confused. So Unshakable gives me steady. Okay, Delgado is going to attack. We'll have Arrow step in and take that hit. Um, we'll have Angel take the hit. I, I, I'm prioritizing the thwart, so if I need to thwart, I can with this. Hello, at the Marvel Champions thinking dance. I don't even know what I was doing. It's just, it's just... I'm just doing it subconsciously at this point. Come on, don't be anything bad. Magnetic bubble is the worst. No. 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 It gives him retaliate and plus eight damage. Oh my gosh. Okay. Retaliate is killer for Colossus because that will knock off the toughs. Um, but it is not actually the worst thing. So this is an interrupt. So it actually... No, it is bad. It's bad. It's bad. Okay. So let's use Bulletproof Protector to knock this tough off and add a second tough. Iron Will Triggers will get to draw a card into armor up. You just said it out loud. That's what happens. <laughs> that card is the most brutal in his deck. 100%. 100% it is. It is so very rough. We haven't even touched him. We haven't even touched him. We're, we're in... We're doing something. <laughs> okay. Um, I 
we are actually in a fairly decent spot though let's go death focus and x jet to play steel fist to kill delgado retaliate does not trigger because we killed him so just get him out of there titanium muscles and armor up will pay for blindfold when blindfold enters play we get to look at the top five which is everything we get to discard one and put the rest back in the same order so exhaustion is our boost card we're fine with that we have caught off guard discard an upgrade or support that we control um metal shards this is an attack defeats an ally plays one magnet counter on the main scheme we're okay with that because we'll just soak it with the tough you are stunned take one damage for each magnet counter on the scheme i think electric shock is probably the one that we get rid of m type sentinel is just bad too um so if we do this it's going to be exhaustion is a boost caught off guard we can what do we get rid of though b cop i think we probably toss b cop or organics no hmm. probably b cop probably b cop yeah i think we get rid of b cop in this situation and then we have metal shards which we will soak that attack and then m type sentinel will be our encounter card which will be a little unfortunate but it it is what it is so we'll place those face up just so we don't forget are you still playing on hard is this first level uh yes yeah so this is expert so we have absolutely we haven't even damaged them we're 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 building we are trying to save but kind of what has what i found with magneto is you you build you build you build and then once we get rid of this stupid thing and this i guess then we can we'll, we'll deck out probably what we'll do is we'll wait till we deck out and then we'll put these in the discard pile and then we can start the stun lock and then we're we'll probably be okay at that point oh no with that no said you're way better at this game than I <laughs> um <laughs> we're in a lot of trouble <laughs> oh man i wanted to get shadow cat out there that would have been nice or for justice i i don't have any more of my any more of my money so what we'll do is we'll use b cop to take this down one b cop will go up to one um blindfold will thwart two she'll take one consequential we'll actually have blindfold probably have blindfold take the hit on this one so we can maintain our tufts which will make titanium muscles a little bit better next turn we're gonna hang on to shadow cat Yeah. he doesn't take damage you know what give him shield too <laughs> that's so true though okay uh we still have a basic activation here what we're going to do is we're gonna take this confused off okay we'll stand up we're gonna get caught off guard which I, I, i'm ooh, actually you know what i may i may toss organic steel and then, well, no, because he can't be confused. Never mind. I'm going to toss Shadow Cat. No, I'm going to keep Shadow Cat. We got Jessica Jones, Limitless Stamina, nice, and a Professor. Ooh, dang it, stupid Magneto's helmet. Okay, but we do, we can get rid of Magneto's helmet if we want to right now. Like, if we make it the basic attack, we can get rid of Magneto's helmet. And then we actually would have, if we did that, then we have the ability to play Professor X and confuse him. So that's nice. But then we don't want Professor X to take the next hit. Because if it if it defeats an ally, we're going to place one magnet counter on this scheme. Which... We'll figure it out when we get there. I'm thinking too far ahead right now. <laughs> uh, we'll place one here. Magneto is going to attack. We're going to have Blindfold take the hit. So it's going to be three plus two. That will kill blindfold. And oh, oh, no, we're gonna we're not gonna see any of these. Well, we're gonna see this. Deal one uh 
one damage to each character you control. So that's kind of a bummer. Um, but because we're going to discard caught off guard and get metal shards, that actually worked out a little bit better because I'm okay. I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that. So when revealed, deal one damage to each character you control. So that's going to knock off this tough, which kind of stinks. We're going to draw a card. Bulletproof Protector. Sweet. Actually sweet. <laughs> Huge. And then Eros just dies. I love Bulletproof Protector here because we can knock this tough off for two toughs and we can maintain our organic steel. So whenever I'm choosing my response windows with Colossus, I always draw the card first before triggering organic steel you get to choose the order of your responses as long as they are responses they're not forced responses and so this is the reason why is because you can draw into like a bulletproof protector and you can maintain your organic steel hey fodder thank you so very much for the sub yeah go team building that iron man suit let's go okay and then we got this m type sentinel Okay. Oh, uh, we got an acceleration token, which isn't great. Hey, hey. <laughs> yes, all the emotes too. Yes. Okay, so I am pretty confident if we are maintaining the schedule that we are used to, then we will get, what is this? Stupid arrows then we will get the announcement of a new Marvel Champions hero tomorrow around 11 a.m. And so that's pretty exciting. I'm We're 99.9% .9 confident it's Rogue, but I'm really excited to see how they how they pull her off. It's going to be it's going to be interesting, but I'm definitely looking forward to tomorrow morning. New Marvel Champion and Marvel Champion announcement day is the best day. Okay, let's use Bulletproof Protector. We'll knock off this tough to place two toughs. Then we get to draw a card from Iron Will, which is the power of justice. We could get Jessica Jones out. Jessica Jones is not doing... Mm. Still looking forward to that campaign contest release. Yeah, they, they, did, they talked about it, but I think that they were going to do something else with it, right? Five brand new community campaigns will be nice. Yeah. Oh, we're going to do a crazy stream when that happens. We're going to play. Yeah, we're going to do a lot of. We're going to stream. We got so much Marvel Champions to stream, y'all. It's going to be so much fun. Alrighty. Okay. <laughs> what are we doing with our lives? They talked about all five of them. Yeah. What an addiction. The need in your eyes. Thankfully, cheaper than other addictions, surprisingly. <laughs> right? I did a short today. Uh, like a YouTube short. It's like. Uh, my mom said I could be whatever I wanted to be when I grew up, when I grew up. And so I became financially irresponsible. <laughs> it's just like a picture of all the, all the LCGs. Uh, incredible. Okay. I'm playing a game here. What, what are we doing? Um, so titanium muscles, let's go ahead and use titanium muscles and the X jet to play shadow cat. We're not going to play Professor X. We need to get rid of this helmet first. So let's go ahead and attack for three. One, two, three. Um, so again, we get to choose our response windows here. Uh, after your hero attacks. Actually, you know what? We're just going to... I think Retaliate 1 triggers first. So Retaliate 1 triggers. Iron Will will get to draw a card into the studio. Um, we're not, mm. you know what? We actually may trigger this organic steel. Let's go ahead and do it. We'll trigger the organic steel to place the second tough back on. And we're going to spend a, yeah, we'll spend a studio passion power of justice and Jessica Jones to get rid of the helmet. Okay, so now he can be confused, which is huge. We will use Death Focus to play Limitless Stamina to stand up. We will swing here, swing here to kill the M-Type Sentinel. We'll give him a tough status card. 
He's already got... Oh, we... Mm. So I guess we did all of that backwards. Because I can't attack Magneto first. So I still think all of that works. Yeah, all of... I guess... I would have had to... T I would have had the studio in my hand and not Professor X. So I would have tossed... Professor X. No, I would have drawn. I would have drawn. We would have been fine. We would have been fine. So we'll hang on to Professor X. But he had guard. That's that's the only thing that I'm concerned about there. So. But I think everything kind of worked out. We'll beat cop this down to one. Dang it, we're going to get another magnetic card. Okay. Stand up. We are getting close to being ready to start the strategy made of rage already armor up and organic steel let's go let's go so we'll place two here on the main magneto is going to attack for three plus a boost i'm thinking we'll take it uh, plus two. Master Plan's gone. That's nice. They'll knock this tough off. We get to draw a card. Sonic Rifle. Okay. Okay. Some good things are happening. Magnetic Triggers. The player defeated the scheme, play, discards the top four cards of their deck. That player places one magnet counter on the main scheme for each magnetic card discarded this way. It's going to be four. Really happy we only discarded one, because if if we're going to have any issues, it's going to be running through this deck multiple times and multiple acceleration tokens. We do have all the Acolytes back in there, so that is actually an issue as well. But let's see what we got. There comes Delgado again. Are we ready to kill him with a beat cop? Actually, we have a Maid of Rage. So we could overkill... And it would not trigger the retaliate. So, yeah. Huge. Let's go. Big fan of that. First, let's use this Titanium Muscles and extra, uh, actually Def Focus to pay for an Organic Steel. We're going to attack and play Made of Rage. When you make a basic attack, discard a tough status card. Discard, response, iron will. We get to draw into a four justice. Uh, you get plus six attack and we get overkill. So we're attacking for nine. So six and then three rolls over and we'll hit this magic bubble. Magnetic bubble. And again, they did just recently make the ruling that forced interrupts take priority over tough status cards, which is why we are placing it here and not knocking off the top. That's a fairly new rule that they put out in the last about two weeks or so. So if I was doing the challenge two weeks ago, that would have been ruled differently. I am looking forward to another rules update. Um... I could Organic Steel for that tough. Let's do it. We'll get the tough back. I'm thinking about doing something dumb. I'm thinking about... Getting Professor X down. Yeah, I'm going to get Professor X down. Then we will confuse Magneto. But what we'll do is roll down and play armor up and still have Professor X take the hit. But that allows us to get shuffled back in, draws us up to, draws us up to six, gets us our second tough status card. All of it kind of works out. So when the villain activates. That's actually interesting. Um...
How how do you all read this? So Armor Up says when the villain activates, change to hero form. Confused says the next time this character would thwart or scheme, discard this card. I think you cannot play Armor Up if he's confused. Because you are he is not activating. Because it you never reach the win activated. So I don't think that actually works. Okay, so we'll not do that. What we'll do is we will We'll just get Professor X out. We'll have him take the hit. And then we will roll down next turn and not worry about armor up. Okay, so let's X-Jet. Let's hang on to Sonic Rifle. X-Jet, four justice and armor up for Professor X. Confused Magneto. Professor X will thwart three off of Magnetic Mayhem. And Beat Cop, which is loaded up now at five counters, will take the last Magnetic Mayhem out. One, two, oh geez, three, three magnet counters? Come on. So three magnet counters, the third one places, we'll discard until we get a magnetic card. It goes under fire, that's nice to see. Okay, Magneto's armor, he cannot be stunned, so that is now priority number one to get rid of. We could kill off Shadow Cat here to get rid of the magnetic bubble. That's a choice. Well, let's just do it. So, Shadow Cat will kill. There's a little bit of conversation around if the Retaliate still triggers after you've taken it out. I think it does. Um,. So when Magneto would take any amount of damage, place it here instead. Um, so that sounds like you resolve the entire attack because then it has a then. So then if there's eight or more, you discard this card. So that's like the... So we'll, we'll Grim rule it if nothing else. So Shadow Cat dies. Okay, we're ready. We got Sonic Rifle. Power Justice, nice. Limitless Stamina. Now clear the area. Okay. We'll place two here on the main, so we're at five out of six. Magneto will attack. Professor X will take the hit. So it's going to be three plus zero and an advance. Nice. Huge to see that advance gone. Place one Magnet Counter here. Bad card is going to be Shadows of the Past. Come on. Why? 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 <laughs> okay, so we're going to get Juggernaut coming out. Stalwart and Toughness. Eight health. Uh, Rampaging Juggernaut. Win a real discard each tough status card from each friendly character. Place two threat here for each tough status card discarded this way. So that's going to be four. We're going to discard this tough. And then we're going to trigger Organic Steel to pull it back. We get to draw a card into Limitless Stamina, and then we'll shuffle these in there. Oh, did, <laughs> did I tune into a D20 stream by mistake? <laughs> I've never seen someone so consistently get Shadows of the Past. It's impressive. I don't know, man. <laughs> I don't know. It's... <laughs> We're fine. We're doing fine. Juggernaut is tough. That's tough to see. Um, okay. Okay, um, let's go ahead and thwart two off the main. Even with that nemesis isn't bad, feels nothing worse than shadows. Yeah, that's true. Um... Juggernaut is tough. Understatement of the year. <laughs> yes. <laughs> nice. Uh, <laughs> okay, so we're going to throw two off the main. Beat Cop. Dude, Beat Cop can almost kill Juggernaut right now. That's pretty sick, though. <laughs> uh, we're going to take one from the main. We're going to use X-Jet to play clear the area to take the last from the main and draw a card. Into, ooh, into Beat Cop. Dangerous. Um, <laughs> more Beat Cops, more fun. No, that'd be crazy, right? 
I need the sonic rifle. <laughs> Let's do death focus to play limitless stamina. To ready up. Actually, we may get rid of that Magneto's armor instead of getting the sonic rifle down. We have another copy of Sonic Rifle in a really small deck, so let's go ahead and do that. Let's make a basic attack against Magneto to knock off the tough, and we'll discard these three to get rid of Magneto's armor. I can see a bunch of cops ganging up on Juggernaut <laughs> and dispersing justice as thematically as possible. Yes. Yes. Um, titanium Muscles to pay for a limitless stamina. Honestly, we may just do that. We may just have B Cop, like, have Juggernaut hang around for a couple turns. Because, like, honestly, he's not. He's not horrible. Because he just soaks in the tough, basically. And then B Cop can just swing and just kill him. So, Limitless Stamina stands us up. I think the Amplify here is a little bit more of an issue. You got a 1 4 Justice. Okay, so both of our four justices are in this deck. We've got two, four, six. So if we roll down, we do deck out. I think we have to roll down regardless, though. The main scheme's at zero, so I think we're fine. And Superman 64, you can just take uh, Dark Side to jail, no biggie. <laughs> yeah, it'll be fine. He'll just stay in there. It'll be it'll be fine. Dude, that game was so fire. That game was so much fun. Is there a treachery that, that gives a minion villainous? If there isn't, there should. I don't think there is, but that's a really good design. That'd be a really cool design. I would like, yeah, that'd, that'd be sweet. I'd, I'd be all about that. Um, uh, we have both clear the areas gone. There's one. Okay, so we have a clear the area in our next hand. So what we'll do is we'll thwart here. Let's stand up. Actually, sorry, I'm flipping down. Oh, we're not gonna deck out. We're not gonna deck out because we're gonna shuffle in a card. That's big, that's big. We're gonna shuffle in. I feel like it has to be organic steel. Could be, I mean, steel fists are. Mm, I'm gonna do steel fist. I'm gonna we're gonna we're gonna start start the steel fist on lock train. We're gonna shuffle a steel fist in there. How many steel fists does Colossus have? Does he have two or three? I think it's three, isn't it? Oh, I should know this. I really should know this. Uh regardless, we're gonna shuffle it in. There may be three could be an issue it okay, stand up two four six yeah he has three we already had one in there bummer probably probably should have done the organic steel instead then oh well we'll place two here on the main magneto will scheme but he's confused we'll remove that juggernaut will scheme for one our bad card is going to be Unstoppable. Attach the enemy with the highest printed attack without a copy of Unstoppable attached. When an enemy attacks, the attack game is Overkill and Piercing. At the end of this attack, discard Unstoppable. I dislike that. I am not a fan of that. Cool. Um, hmm. Unstoppable Juggernaut? It's, it's absurd. <laughs> Really, it's the, it's the piercing that's really tough. So we do have to take care of Juggernaut this turn. I wonder what this is. I guess we'll find out. But we can we can we can take care of Juggernaut. B Cup will deal. Oh, we have a Maid of Rage. That's even better. We have a Maid of Rage, so we can kill Juggernaut with Overkill onto Magneto, and then Steel Fist, and we can keep our B Cup. <laughs> the beat cup's gonna be so swole. Let's go. Okay. Um, okay. So on my turn, got nothing to do here. So we'll flip up, get our second tough status card. Hmm. 
The annoying part is actually this tough. I forgot about that. Let's extra for clear the area. Take this away. And then we get to draw a card and a Wiccan. Nice. Nice. That actually solves some problems. We decked, so we get a card. Because we can have Wiccan take care of that tough, and then, then we're off to the races. Okay. Okay, so we could... Or we're we're going to get Wiccan out no matter what. So let's go Titanium Muscles for a Whiffin. Um, now the question is, do we risk it and thwart? No, we don't. We're, we're just going to attack and knock this tough off. This is too big to not, not take off. Dude, this is, this is absurd. Overkill and piercing is brutal. It's literally just hitting you for six. And there's not much you can do about it. <laughs> Dang. Okay. Um, let's make a basic attack. Colossus Justice. Hey, Armetheus, how you doing? Yes. Colossus Justice. We're doing it. Things are happening. We have not damaged Magneto in an hour and 13 minutes yet. <laughs> you haven't seen an overkill and piercing since like what? Ronin, right? Yeah, because Rhino doesn't have piercing. His stampede or whatever just is overkill. So we're going to make a basic attack. We're going to discard a tough status card and play a Mate of Rage to give us plus six. So that's going to roll one over to Magneto. Sorry, I just I just had a really interesting... I feel like an Overkill deck with Colossus would be really cool with Made of Rage. Huh. First Blood on Magneto. One damage. Let's go. We get to draw a card because we discarded for Iron Will. There's a 4 Justice, which is kind of nice. Okay. Okay, it's happening, everybody. It is happening. Let's go ahead and... We'll hang on to the Steel Fist. We'll pretend like it's not in our hand. Um... We'll Death Focus and Sonic Rifle for a Seal Fist. So deal 5 damage to Magneto. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. We will discard this tough card to give him Stunning Confused. We get to draw a card from Iron Will. Actually, instead of Sonic Rifle, we are going to discard for Justice. We're going to hang on to Sonic Rifle. We'll get to draw into the studio. So now we can play Sonic Rifle. Okay. Okay. Beat Cop will take one. Beat Cop is Beef Cop now. It's Beef Cop. It's happening. It's happening. It's working. Okay, so Genius in the studio will play pay a Sonic Rifle. We'll hang on to a Seal Fist. We'll probably just hang on to this for a couple turns, honestly. Um, Because... Yeah, we'll hang on to it for two turns. We could probably... No, we'll shuffle the other one back in. Alrighty, so let's stand up. Seal Fist. Clear the area. Shadow Cat. Power of Justice. Place two on the main. Magneto is stunned. So now we're resolving two cards. The first one, M-Type Sentinel. Second one is Zeal for the Cause... We have to discard cards until we get an Acolyte minion. Okay, well, Unisone. Teamwork and Toughness. When defeated, give the villain a tough status card. Okay, well, that was... That happened. Um, hmm. Cool. Cool. We have a we have beef cop up up here. He can take out some some insane. He can do some work. I'm, that's all I'm saying. Um, let's go ahead and X jet for a clear the area. No, no, no. First, um, let's have whiff and thwart one off of the main. We'll discard this for zero. Dang it. Stupid whiffin. Ah, that that's a bummer. That's a bummer. <laughs> um, 
<laughs> of course, though. Of course. I don't know what I was expecting. Let's go ahead and knock this tough off of Unison. We'll use a Death Focus and X Jet to play Steel Fist to kill Unison. So we'll give Magneto a tough card. Do we just beat cop the heck out of this M type Sentinel? <laughs> I'm just saying. It could be pretty cool. Let's do it. Let's just get rid of it. Um, so we'll exhaust B cop and deal seven to this Sentinel. We give Magneto a tough status card. He already has one, though. Um, all of our resources are gone. So we will use a Power of Justice to play clear the area to take this down to two. And we will flip down. Yeah, we'll do a Seal Fist. Alrighty. Down to 14. Let's go. Alrighty, let's ready. Draw six. We're going to toss Shadow Cat. Blindfold. Armor up. Nope. Limitless stamina. Bulletproof protector, huge. Limitless stamina. Oh, jeez. One, two, three, four, five. Lim oh, my gosh. So many limitless staminas. Let's go. Okay, nice. We'll place two here on the main. Magneto will scheme, but he's confused. We got one encounter card. Gang up. This card gains surge because we're an alter ego. Electric shock. You are confused. Place one threat on the main scheme for each magnet counter on it. So that's going to get one. And then I have one of my confused cards. Okay. Let's go. Let's do it. We're going to flip up to Colossus. We get a tough status card. We are going to play Bulletproof Protector to discard the tough and add a tough. And then, oops. And then we got Iron Will to draw us a card. Beat Cop, let's go. <laughs> more Beat Cop, more fun. Uh, <laughs> I honestly think we do throw Beat Cop out there, though. Um, be hilarious. Let's Titanium Muscles and X Jet to play Beat Cop. Let's just. She did such good work for us last time, so we'll go ahead and just take one threat off the main. Just start that process over. Um, okay, so... I'm trying to figure out if I want to play a ton of Limitless Staminas or get Blindfold out. Pro probably Blindfold. Limitless Staminas sound more fun, though. Uh, one thing we will do is we will Sonic Rifle to confuse Magneto. Um, uh, you know what? We're not going to do that. We'll wait until next turn to see if we need to do it. Um... Let's have Whiffin go ahead and try his last... We're going to... No. No. Blindfold comes out first. Yeah. Okay, so let's... We'll hang on to one Limitless Stamina. We got Armor Up, Limitless Stamina, and Limitless Stamina to play Blindfold. We have to look at the top five. Oh, big. Two, three, four, five. Big Brain. Yeah. So slam, that would deal two damage. M-Type Sentinel would then be our um, boost card. We may just do cut off guard. Then the villain, then we get an assault. So if we do, if we take out the M-Type Sentinel, within boost, assault, boost. I think that's probably fine. The, assault, the assault's going to be fine. We have blindfold to, to, to soak the hit. If we need it. Okay. Yeah, let's do that. 
Blindfold's so cool. Blindfold's sick. I, I, uh, like, I'm putting Blindfold in so many of my Justice decks right now. She is just so incredibly good in power. It's, it's insane. Okay. So Within will thwart this. Discard this to deal two damage, which will knock the tough off. Within dies. Blindfold will go ahead and thwart two. Oh, she's not dead. Not yet. Uh, let's go ahead and swing for three. Death focus, limitless stamina, stand up, swing for three more. So that's six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Down to eight. We'll stand up. Whiffin needed help from a blind person <laughs> properly. <laughs> yes. <laughs> uh, that's embarrassing, isn't it? Okay, we'll stand up and we'll draw four cards. We got energy made of rage. Sonic Rifle again, and then Eros. Okay. Two goes on the main. Magneto is going to attack for three plus a boost. We'll take it. Caught off guard, knocks a tough off. We get to draw a card into Jessica Jones. And then we have an Assault. Okay, so the Assaults, actually this goes here. Um, then we have an assault. So that would trigger a magnetic card, which would get Sinyaka out, out of the way, which actually would be fine. I'd like it's doing it no matter what, but I think we let it soak the tough in case we get the one that deals one damage. There are two of those. I wonder if we've seen both of them. Uh, so electric shock is one. Okay. So we won't get damaged. So we don't have to let it soak the tough. We're still at two health. I forgot about that. I forgot how low of health we are. Um, if we protect the tough, what do we want to play? We want to get arrows. We can play arrows. We. We want to play Sonic Rifle, I guess. So we don't need the tough. We, we can get it out. We can get rid of it without the tough. So we're good. I was just thinking you have balls of steel hanging at two health for so long. No, I just completely forgot. It's fine. Uh, <laughs> okay, so Assault's going to hit us. We're going to take three plus three, which will soak the tough. Which will draw us a card into an organic steel. That changes math a lot. Um, and then that's the third counter. So we will discard until we get magnetic cards. Okay, that's not too bad. Place two additional here, two threat here for each ally in play. So that's going to be four and a crisis. Okay. Okay. Um, to use energy to play organic steel. Let's have I'm thinking. Eros is probably more beneficial at this point than the second Sonic Rifle. Especially because how many Made of Rages do we have here? Or Steel Fist, I'm sorry. We have two Steel Fists still in our deck. So we're going to be Stunlocked. So the Sonic Rifle is just going to be damaged. So I'm, I'm, a, I'm able to justify letting that pass. So let's go ahead and toss a Sonic Rifle and the X-Jet for an Eros. And then we don't have to kill Blindfold. So that's nice. Um, we'll thwart two, four to take this down. That's gone. Beat Cop is going to do Beat Cop things. We will Sonic Rifle and Confuse Magneto. We're going to we're going to hang on to a Maid of Rage, honestly, because I'm feeling that we're going to get a minion. Because we haven't seen a lot of the Acolytes come through. There's one. 
two. Yeah, we have a lot. Oh, there's still Gatos. We still have the dad or whatever. I don't remember his name right now. Um, okay, so let's flip down to Pitor. What are we shuffling in? Not an armor up. Maybe a bulletproof protector. Or a steel fist. I feel like the enemy's gate is down. We just got to go for it, right? So... Yeah, we'll do a steel fist. Sonic Rifle is sick for solo, isn't it? I don't know why I don't... Sonic Rifle is sick. Yeah. Sonic Rifle is so good. If you have the economy to pay for it, which Colossus very much does once he's built, it's so good. And 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 if you don't need to confuse, it's three damage, right? Which is really significant in solo, right? I mean, that's 15% of stage two of Magneto. Like, not bad. We're going to hang on to Mate of Rage. And we're going to ready up. I'm going to draw four Justice, Angel, Organic Steel, one, two, three, four. Steel Fist, there we go. Steel Fist, let's go. Let's go. Yes. Okay. Um, so we got two here. Magneto is going to scheme, but he's confused. Bad card is going to be Magnetic Missile. That surges. And to the Acolytes. Each Acolyte minion gains guard. We're going to get rid of that so fast. Don't like that at all. Because that has also a hazard. But. Okay. Let's go ahead and heal for four. One, two, three, four. Hey, Dark Maverick. Is this still the original game? You had to leave for a bit. I don't. You don't have to say it like that. But yes. No, it is. It is still the original game. We had a lot of problems come up. And we have now solved those problems. We've got our engine oiled, and we are kind of off to the races at this point. So, um, doing doing pretty good actually now. Now that we're now that we're rocking and rolling. So <laughs> that's super impressive <laughs> that I have that type of endurance. <laughs> oh man. Okay. So we healed. We're gonna flip up. We're gonna get that tough card. Titanium Muscles and Death Focus will pay for a Steel Fist. Um, no, no, no. First, we're going to pay for an Organic Steel. We're not going to, we're going to use X-Jet for that instead. Okay. We are going to hang on to that. Let's use a four justice and a made of rage to pay for a steel fist. So deal five damage to Magneto. One, two, three, four, five, down to three. We'll trigger both of our organic steels to replenish two toughs. We get to draw into a third, another Steel Fist and Sun and Confuse. Okay. Um, titanium Muscles will pay for Angel. That was my health. No! <laughs> one, two, three. He's down to three. I'm not down to one. That'd be horrendous. Um... Let's just have Blindfold thwart two off the Acolytes, and then B-Cop will take the last one off the Acolytes. Get rid of that. We have two Steel Fists. We only need, we only really need one of them. We could push Magneto here. I think we're in a spot where we want to do that, so let's go ahead and do it. Blindfold also dies. Yes, thank you. I was already on to the next thing. <laughs> um, I think we push Magneto. We're going to push Magneto with the Sonic Rifle. 
So Sonic Rifle will trigger dealing 3 damage uh, to Magneto, which will push Magneto and taking him back up to 22. Steady Toughness. Deal each player a face down encounter card. But he doesn't have Steady because of uh, physical strain. We're okay if we lose the main at this point. So I'm just going to hang out. We'll use Angel to knock this tough off. We'll have Arrow's Thwart too. Just because he'll probably die from a from a encounter card. Let's be honest. Plus it gets him back in the deck. So we're going to hang on to... So this is this is, each one of these is each one of these is five damage minimum, right? Uh, there's one made of rage there. There's the second made of rage. Um, so we we have five eight. We're gonna. Mm, yeah, we'll toss one of the steel fists. We'll shuffle it back in because we won't we won't deck out. So we'll shuffle it back in. We'll get it right back. Okay, so it's ready. Strength, bulletproof protector, nice, and Professor X. Honestly, Professor X, I'm going to use to ready myself probably. Place two, he's going to attack, he's stunned. Two bad cards. The first one is advance, because of course it is. There goes the confused, but that's huge, because we still have a steel fist. Nice, nice, <laughs> nice, love it. And then our second one is seize. When revealed, each player places the top six cards of their deck face down under here. We only have three. Uh, when defeated, Magneto activates against the player who defeated the scheme. Discard the cards under here. Um, so we deck out. We get another encounter card, which we will resolve right now. Think about just leaving that. It is a little unfortunate that we, we shuffled our Steel Fist back in, but we will use the Steel Fist and be able to shuffle it right back in. Oh, really? I thought you'd resolve the encounter card next turn. No, you never carry over face down encounter cards, ever. So, um, that, that was, I forgot what, I forgot what that was ruled on, but if, if you are dealt an encounter card during the villain phase, it will be resolved at the villain phase, no matter what. So, um... So the next one is Amelia Vaught, Stalwart, Teamwork, Acolyte. Okay. So my turn. My turn again. Um, even if it's after step seven, yes. Yes. Um, I, I can't remember. It was something I think in like galaxies. I want to say it was something in galaxies. Um... Now I'm starting to contra. Now I'm starting to. Now I'm starting to get worried, but I'm pretty sure, and we can we'll we'll verify in the Discord once this is over. But I'm pretty sure no encounter card ever rolls over to the next stage. I think it always gets resolved. So, someone ask on the Discord, and I'm sure jo Josh will respond within like three seconds and tell me I'm wrong. But okay, so we got 22 damage to deal. Let's hit Magneto for three. One, two, three. Um, Titanium Muscles and the X-Jet will play Professor X, which will...
We will ready um, Colossus. Yeah, this, this is this is actually gonna work. We will thwart three off of. Oh no, because that's gonna hurt. That's gonna kill Professor X. Um, hmm. I'm gonna bring Professor X back. I have to figure out the math on this. Um. You can thwart three off the main or something. I can't. Yes, I can. I was thinking about thwarting three off of here and then having Magneto attack me and then have Professor X block for me, but th th it just doesn't work out that way. But I could have Professor X go out. So Steel Fist is five. Um, we have to deal nineteen. Steel Fist is five. Attack is three. Bulletproof protectors. Six, so that's eleven, taking him down to eight. Professor X can ready. That'd be leaving him at five, which is just a cup, which is just a little short, but enough. We're gonna place three on the main, so we will beat cop the main. But I think that's what we'll do. I think, yeah. I mean, I don't, I don't see any reason to not do that. So let's go ahead and. Titanium, uh, nope. Uh, Death Focus and X Jet to play Steel Fist. Five damage to Magneto. One, two, three, four, five. Um, we'll discard this tough card. We will trigger Organic Steel to put the tough card tough card back. Um, Stun and Confuse. Magneto. We get to draw into a Steel Fist. Is that game? No. No, that can't be game, right? It will. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Um, so he's at 14. We've got 5 down to 9. 3 down to 6. Down to 4. And then we have Professor X to ready for one more. So it kind of depends on what we draw with the Titanium Muscles. Um, ah, ha, 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 ha. You can let Professor X take Amelia's attacker. That's true. I can. And then protect the tough. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. I think regardless, we have it next turn. So... Um, You know, actually, yeah, we're gonna yeah we're gonna hit Magneto for three, one two three. Angel will hit him for two one two. Down to eleven. We've got bulletproof protector. We'll discard this tough card. We will bring it back with organic steel to ready, and we get to draw a card and to clear the area doesn't help. Um. We got three, one, two, three. Oh wait, no, we 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 do have it. Yeah, we have it. We have it. Uh, strength will pay for a steel fist, which will be five. One, two, three, four, five. Titanium muscles clear the area. Professor X readies and will attack for three. One, two, three. I don't know why my math was so off on that one, but yep, there you go. Okay, just checked. Resolving encounter cards in step six. Step nine is passing the first player token, and step ten is ending turn. So yeah, all encounter cards of that turn will inevitably be resolved at the last thing of the phase. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Yeah. Well, that was kind of exciting. That was a crazy last turn. Yeah. Okay. Well, there you go. Colossus did it in justice on the first try on stream. And so that that's kind of interesting. Um, also, I did not think that this was... Like, when we started out this game... It was not looking good at all. And so being able to like continue, like just, I don't know. We were able to get Iron Will early. Titanium Muscles also came out pretty early. So that was huge for us. Um, the beat cops were, were, did some work, which was nice. But all in all, it like Colossus Justice. And Colossus, I feel like I kind of maybe gave him too bad of a rating. 
because considering that we were able to we didn't get iron wheel turn one and we were able to beat expert magneto makes me think that colossus probably isn't as bad as i may have given him a rating for which i think was like low b tier so interesting defeating the uh defending that last turn defeating the villain was also the most boring part of the game <laughs> right <laughs> uh 1.5 hour game for single player wow i don't know how to make a sentence i'm sorry <laughs> no you're fine <laughs> well it was expert yeah and i find that all of whenever i'm streaming i i double the game length and so the practice game took 38 minutes so but whew, okay yeah that was exciting that was really exciting so i'm with the new ruling of how they do the magnetic counters i am back to really enjoying magneto as a encounter i think that he's very difficult but he can also be like not overbearingly difficult and so i i'm happy about that yeah okay so that's gonna be it for new ruling new ruling new ruling uh so you remove the magnet counters before you resolve the magnet card so if if you were on the stream or you're on the discord i was talking i was asking the question that like a couple of these cards that um place the magnet counter so like electromagnetic blast the way that i was reading it um yes it was what you mentioned in the comment section yeah so they they ruled which makes it not as hard and completely contradicts what the main scheme says but they say that you remove the counters then resolve the card which is very not what it says on the main scheme but that's what they did say is what is what happens but it prevents the cascade into oblivion so nice Alrighty. Okay. So next stream is going to be Friday at 1 PM. We're going to be continuing on in our Arkham Horror Dunwich Legacy campaign with Professor Meg. And then we will be back on Monday to finish up some Scarlet Witch uh, um, Hero Spotlight. And then I have to figure out what I'm doing with my life next week because I'm, I'm out um, a couple days. And so just... I will post it on the Discord, on YouTube, all of that stuff, what the stream schedule is going to look like for next week, because I'm still trying to figure out, trying to work out schedules and everything. So excited to continue on. And we got one more, which is going to be Jean Grey leadership. And Jean Grey, Jean, Jean, Jean uh, Phoenix can throw down in some leadership. So excited to try it out. Thank you all so very much for spending your Wednesday evening with me. It does mean the world. I appreciate you all, and I hope you all have a fantastic rest of the week. See you around. Peace.